Good morning, friends. I hope everybody had a fun weekend, and I loved our Zoom meeting this morning where we got to show something that started with our the name of our first letter, like K for me, SketchUp. I loved it. I thought it was super fun to see everybody. Um, today, we're going to start talking about Passover, and one of the things special about Passover is that we have on the very first night of Passover, we have a special dinner. It's called a Seder, and on the Seder, it's very special because it is a time when we have um, tell the story of Moses and King Pharaoh and all the bad things that we did, to, that God did to King Pharaoh in order to, for him to free the Jews out of Israel, uh, out of Egypt, and they were able to walk across the walk. You know, Moses parted the sea, and the Jews walked through, and went to Israel, and it's the time of telling the story of, in the history of the Jewish people, and how Moses saved them. It's very important, but what's cool about this dinner is that on every table across the entire world, every Jewish family is going to have more, all these special things on their table. Kind of like at Thanksgiving, everybody has a turkey. Well, kind of, it's it's like that. So we have a lot of different things. And all these things on our Seder table have meaning. And we're going to learn about all the meanings and stuff later as we go. But right now, we're just going to learn about what actually goes on it. Uh, one thing that goes on it is we have candles. We have wine. We have a special book. It's called... The Haggadah, and the Haggadah is especially, it's just a special book that just tells the story. And then we also have matzah, 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 we'll have lots of matzah, ah, ah. And we also have a special tape, a plate called the Seder plate. Here's a hard copy one, but maybe it can help. And I have all the real stuff on it too. Like, we'll have a hard boiled egg. We'll have parsley that we dip into salt water, and then we have lettuce, we have bitter herbs, and um, bitter herbs can be a couple of things. It could be a horse radish root or just radishes. Um, we'll have a shank bone to represent the lamb, and we'll also have chlorosis, which uh, represents the mortar that uh, the Egyptians, the Israelites had to use to make all those big pyramids. Um, and it's basically just apples and nuts and a little wine. Um, and those are the main things that you're going to find on your Seder table. Um, so, but there's a book here I thought I would read that will tell us a little bit about this too. This is the Seder table. Now look at that. There's nothing on that table yet. So we're going to add stuff to the Seder table. We're going to add, this is the matzah, crispy and fine. This is the cup we fill with wine that goes on the Seder table. So you see, they put the cup and um, the matzah there. This is the Haggadahs that tell the story of slavery and suffering and final glory. See the book? This is the cup of wine we fill. And this is the matzah, crispy and fine, that goes on the Seder plate. Seder table. See? Okay, now we have the cup, we have the matzah, and we have the Haggadahs. They're all on everybody's table so they can read them. Okay, this is the water that Papa pours. Pours water on our hands to clean our hands. So I'll put that over here. This is the roasted egg and the bitter herb. And that is with the Haggadahs, which tell the story of slavery and suffering and finally glory. And 
and with the cup of wine and the matzo, crispy and fine. And they all go on the Seder table. See, I go backwards every time, sorry. It's getting more and more stuff on that table. Ah, oh, this is the spring parsley that represents the new beginnings. And this is the apples and honey, ap apples and nuts. And this is the um, shank bone, which is on the plater plate that is roasted and added to the Seder plate with the egg and the bitter roots and the, um, the water and the, our book, the Haggadahs and the wine, and the purse, the hot matza. Look, it's even getting more and more busier, more and more stuff. Can more stuff go on there? I don't know. <gasps> These are the candles that mama will light. Here they are. And the wine for the Seder plate with the spring parsley, with the apples and nuts, with the shank bone, with the egg, with the bitter root, with the Haggadah, the cup of wine, and the matzah on the Seder plate. Look, there's even more stuff, putting more stuff out. And that is exactly it. This is the family and some friends joined together and the daylight ends. Everyone listens as the candles light and so begins the Seder night. Happy Passover! There, can you see? So those are all the fun things that we will be learning more about, and we'll be learning what, why we make horses, which is so, so yummy. We might make that together one day. And why we have matzah. There's a reason. It's coming. We'll tell you. Lots of fun things to learn coming forward. Um, I will hope to see you guys tomorrow morning on Zoom. Well, we are talking about shapes. You need to go out and find something with the shape of a Z, of a O, a circle, or in the shape of a square. I don't know. I think I found my square. Anyway, have a good day. We'll talk to you soon.